Hello everyone, I am Arbit Kumar Sharma and welcome back to Pabli. So today I am going to tell you how you can share RSS feeds to Telegram automatically. Okay, so suppose you are a food blogger and you are tracking several food sites which are giving you information regarding different recipes, regarding different tastes, regarding different types of foods from different types of places, be it states, cities, countries, etc. So what you can do, you can take the RSS feeds from those websites and then can use that in Fably Connect to directly send those informations to your Telegram group or I should say to a particular Telegram group which in which people have been following you especially for that food blogging. Okay. Now this automation can be used in various different purposes also. This is just an example on how to use this one. Now to do this automation, we are going to use an integration and automation service Pabli Connect which will help us connect the RSS feed links from other websites to our Telegram account. Now, if you want to learn this very useful and very amazing automation, you have to come with me to the screen. And we are back at our screen. So what we have to do, we have to go to the address bar and type in P-A-B-B-L-Y pabli.com slash connect and then press enter. And as soon as we will do that, you will see we will have these two options. Either you can sign in or you can sign up. If you already have an account here, you can just go for sign in. If you do not have an account, you have to go for sign up. Signing up is absolutely free and we are also giving you 100 free tasks every month. Okay. Now what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to go and sign in because I already have an account here. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to click on access now for Pabli Connect. And here what I'm going to do, you can see here, these are all the automations I have. I'll just go to create workflow. And here I am going to give my workflow a name. So let us give it this name and I am giving the name RSS feed to Telegram. Okay, so I'm using Telegram and RSS feed here. So I'm giving it this name. You can name it whatever you want to. Let's click on create and after doing that, you will see you will have two windows. First one is trigger and second one is action. Now trigger window is the window where an event is happening at the start of the process. Action window is the window where an event is happening at the end of the process or when the final event is happening. So trigger means when this happens, action means do this. So what we are going to do first in a trigger, we are going to take the RSS by Pabli. And now we are going to go for new item in feed. Now click on connect. And when you will do that, you, it will ask you for the feed URL. So what we are going to do, we are just going to take any feed, say sports. So I am copying this here. And after copying this link, I'll just paste it here. <coughs> and then I will click on save and send test request. Now when I will do that, it will capture the latest news on that particular feed, which is this one, Korea Open. PV Sindhu marches into quarterfinals. Kidambi Shrikant defeats Misha Zilberman. Okay. So this is the title and this is the link. Now what will happen? Whenever we are going to run this automation, first it will take the, uh, you know, the latest information. And then this will run every eight hours, which means that in every eight hours, it will grab the information from the feed link and then it will transfer it to the Pabli Connect. And from there, it will transfer to the application that we are going to use in the action step. And in this case, Telegram. So this uh, automation will run every eight hours. So do not expect your news every five minutes, every 10 minutes or every one hour, two hour. Okay. Now here in action, what we are going to do, we are just going to go for Telegram. So we will select Telegram bot. And we will go for send a text message or a reply. Then we will click on connect, add new connection and it will ask you for the token. So what you have to do for the token, you can see here it is written go to HTTPS telegram bot father create a new bot and you can read the remaining instructions. I am just going to tell you how to do that. So let, uh, to how to do this. So let's go to telegram here. You can see this is the bot father. I will click on restart bot. Now here you can see to create a new bot, we have to put slash new bot then we have to give it a name so i'm giving it the name rss feed rss feed now here you can see it is asking me to put underscore bot suffix here so i will say rss feed underscore bot now what is the problem let me see this username is invalid. Okay, let me just change it. R S S feed. Uh, 
अंडर स्कोर बॉट ओके दिस यूजर नेम इज ऑलरेडी टेकन आर एस एस फीड ऑटोमेशन अंडर स्कोर बॉट नाउ दिस वुड बी सक्सेसफुल यस सो आर एस एस फीड ऑटोमेशन अंडर स्कोर बॉट वी आर गोइंग टू यूज दिस वन लेट मी जस्ट कॉपी दिस बिफोर कॉपिंग दिस फर्स्ट आई हैव टू कॉपी दिस विच इज दिस वन द टोकन विच वी हैव टू पुट इन आर पैब्लिक कनेक्ट अकाउंट सो फर्स्ट कॉपी दिस गो बैक टू योर पैब्लिक कनेक्ट अकाउंट एंड पेस्ट इट हेयर देन क्लिक ऑन सेव and after clicking on save you will see your telegram will be connected to your pavli connect account now here it is asking you for the chat id so what is that chat id let me just explain it to you first let me make a group here because we are going to uh, put this on group so we will go for new group here i am going to add my bot rss feed automation okay so this is my bot now you can see this is our bot i will just click on this and then i will go forward and here i am just going to give the group name and the group name is r s s feed automation okay now i am just going to click here and you can see the new group has been created here now to uh, for our automation to work properly what we have to do we have to make this rss feed automation bot our admin of this group so what we have to do we have to make this uh, bot admin through mobile because it is not possible to make it through this pc that uh, telegram web does not give us that info sorry that permission to do that so what i am going to do i am just going to go to my mobile and open my telegram and make it a make it an admin so just wait for a few seconds let me do that okay so my rss feed automation underscore bot is now an admin of this group so now what we are going to do through automation we are going to send the rss feeds to this group so now here you can see <coughs> that uh, i have been showing you this chat id from the start of this process in second action window now what we are going to do we are going to go here and as you can see here it is written z okay so whenever you are using telegram you have to use the z version not old version not k version you have to use the z version only here you are going to get the chat id and this is the chat id so you have to copy this without the hashtag you have to copy this this is the chat id of bot father this is the chat id of our group so copy this from minus to to go back and paste it here okay i hope you are not confused now it is asking us for the text message so what we are going to do we are just going to use a technique which is called mapping and mapping will let us take the data from this window and it will let us put the data here in this window so i'll just go for hello everyone oh i am really sorry this is the mapping part hello everyone here are the news feeds for and which did we take we did sports okay we took the sports one so here are the sports news let me just put it like this from z news now what we are going to do we are just going to map the data title is this and description or link is this so i'll just go here i will type in title and here i will type in the link okay
now we will go here and click on save and send test request and as soon as we will do that you will see an okay message which means our message has been sent and here you can see in our telegram hello everyone here are the sports news from z news title korea open pv sindhu matches into quarter finals kidambi shrikant defeats misha zilberman and link is this and here you can see this is the news so this is how you can do this automation and this is how you can connect your telegram to your rss feeds so that whenever you are going to have new uh, new news in those rss feeds your telegram will automatically have a new message in that particular group okay now i cannot show you that in real time right here right now because it will take eight more hours for rss to take the feeds and that is why we are not going to show this right now but you can just try it yourself within every eight hours you are going to have lots and lots of news into your group telegram group okay so this automation is very easy and very 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 beautiful you can use it in your telegram channel especially if you are a blogger or if you are into you know <clears throat> giving information on uh, particular topics you can use this automation and if you want to use this automation directly you can just go into my description box and clone the workflow from there into your account and for that you need to have an account and for that you need to go and sign up signing up is absolutely free and we are also giving you 100 free tasks every month so do not wait go and sign up now Hasta la vista. So thanks a lot for watching our video. I hope you understood everything. Now, if you want any other events to add it in our module, what you can do is you can mail us at admin at the rate pebbly dot com. If you have any queries regarding this software, you can just ask your queries at this website at this link. And if you want to check the prices, you can visit here to this link and check the prices of the software. Now, I just want to tell you. that automation is a boon for us and it can change the future and i will you know suggest you to take this as quickly as possible which will ease your task save your time and save you a lot and lot of efforts thank you